Sarah. The free city of Stonehelm. Crossroads of money and magic. Deliver the crystal to Manalag and we can be on our way. I hope so. It's been pretty dull. We should go back to the city. Where it's safe. The farther we get, the better. It's our home. It'll be our tomb if you don't drive faster. There's an army of necromancers coming. Necromancers? Fenric didn't say anything about them. Master Fenric rarely tells everything he knows. Hurry, we'll be safer inside. I'm the envoy from Master Fenrir, with a message for the wizard Menelag. That's Lord Menelag. Got any proof? That's We're a little wary of strangers these days. I have a letter of introduction. Let me see it then. Hmm. By special request of Lord Menelag. And there's a seat. Let me welcome you to Stonehelm. We'll stable your horse for you if it pleases you. Of course. Can you tell me where to find Menelag? Certainly, sir. You go uphill past the Golden Ribbon and... Sweet Dragon's Blood, what's that? there buddy did you hey everybody welcome to part two of dark messiah might and magic bloody me out here and uh we're escaping from ogre infestation of the city of stonehelm we were just going to deliver the shantari crystal but that didn't really happen did it To the military, you know, just like just like old times in, in, in good old U.S. of A. This game's also immensely dark. Uh, I have the brights actually the entire way up because I know that it gets much darker during YouTube processing. I've learned that. Trying to take care of the Cyclops, Ballista style. This should be enough to kill it. It'd be nice to shoot him in the eye, but unfortunately, it's just uh, body shots. This Come on, time. Sarah, keep up your fire. Pretty strong freaking ballistas, though. I don't know if it's like an explosive enchantment on the tip of the you arrow there or what. It. You did it. I'd hug you if I could.
That's you all clear. They're retreating. For now. All right. It looks like we uh, solved the yoga problem there. The Cyclops frog getting more and more like it. So, got some skill points here. The way this works is that certain things are worth one skill point, some worth a three. You have a bank, and you expend the points, and some points cost more than just one point. So, being the stealth guy, we need to know, I need to get to the most important skill is stealth, and level two, to be exact, allows you to use your daggers to backstab an enemy for extra damage. So let us grab the first one of stealth, which decreases the sound of your footsteps when walking. And so when you walk, like this, holding alt, I um, am quiet, or crouching. So, we still have two more skill points, but I want to save to for the four skill point of the backstab. Nice work there, friend. You've got some real potential. Thanks there, Brotato. So... You handle yourself pretty well in a fight. Care to join us for a pint of Golden Rivet? <laughs> you know, honestly, the only thing I think this game does poorly is, like, the social interaction. It's so cheesy. But, I mean, it's, a might. it's might and magic, so it is a little cheesy. A book about Ash's creatures. Weaknesses. Double-click to read it. So, uh, well, I'll get this uh, tutorial out of the way before I do so. Thank you. I know. I understand. Couple uh, got a hold in the button to make it go up type of deals here when you gotta hurry through the um, thing. But let's read this book here. I'm not gonna read it. Just pause the YouTube video and read it for your own pleasure, or we're gonna close it right now. Works for me, works for you, works for the people that wanna read it. I like it. And also, I enjoy the level transitions. It kinda, it, it's based off the Source Engine, at least I believe it is. It has to be. Like, holy crap. But um, yeah, yeah, definitely. That's what I'm talking about. And uh, don't do it. I like the way it says in the hint. Just, just don't do it, even if you want to try. All right, so we gotta pick our uh, class here. Although really, we can pick any of this stuff. I'm gonna pick the bow, of course, and equip the bow. So uh, let's see. You know, we got a bow now. No arrows though for it. Don't need the shield. And in here we have daggers, which is gonna be our main uh, attraction here, I believe. So let us switch out over here, and that to two. There we go. Yes. Love the way that he uses daggers in this game, too. And um, one of the coolest parts about this game is the way that... Do that. We're trapped. We'll need I doubt it. For sure. Ghouls don't swim well. What do we do with the bodies? If the necromancers get their hands on them... We might have to open up the necropolis. So cheesy. For the last time, there are no necromancers in the city. They've got you fooled too, I see. But they can't fool me. And I tell you, the streets aren't safe. Clear off, you. You've got no business here. They tried launching skeletons over the wall. What happened to them? Splintered on impact, mostly. You know anybody that can repair armor? No, I'm not a weaponsmith or an armorsmith. Blacksmith, so... Can't do that. It's the same every time. We always run out of arrows. Oh. Isn't that a shame? So, all we really have to do is get to the front. Got to wash the blood out of things. Wash off the blood. Leave her be, Sarah. She's not important. And, um, we just have to go to the front of the drawbridge to meet our, uh, escort. But, there actually are secrets. You know what they say about the size of a man's front gate? That big one must be Manalag's. And the uh, character that is like in our head, as you saw in that cutscene, her name is Xana. She might have been uh, a little hard to hear because she whispers it to you, so uh, that's her name, Xana, with an X. So let us get our first secret of the game here. And to do that, we have to kind of climb up here, and you can actually hang on to ledges and pull it yourself up. That when those, when items are glowing like that, it's a it's a item that you can collect. And I gotta say, before I jump here, I love the "You Found a Secret" music in this game. It is my favorite of of like of any game because it makes you feel so good about yourself. <sighs> oh, you're so awesome! It's what it's what, it's what I it's what I say to myself when I get it. It's awesome. 
Take an apple? Why not? But, since we're a thief, we actually are looking for one more particular, um, area. And that will lead us to a lovely, lovely secret that is going to help us with our stealth, like I said. And that would be it for this area, I would th Yeah, I think so. I don't know where all of these secrets are in this game, but, um... I know a good many, and I know the ones that are going to be important. I just got to kind of locate and kind of figure out where the door is to where I want to go. Actually, I think this might be it. Yes, this is it. Yep. All right. So, see, like it's like this is what I like. Like this is this is totally an essential place. I'm kind of just chilling out and looking around. But what's really cool about this is that this game is actually very linear. It's a very, there's just there's 12 levels. You just go you just go in them in order. However, there's so much off the beaten path. It's nice. Scroll of freeze, so you can use magic without being a mage, but only limited supply. And uh, look at this. This this thing has a little um, inventory icon on a lantern. Look at that. Hey, here comes that music. <sighs> and what do we got in the attic? Gutting Chris. Ooh. I need stealth. Two, level 2 to use it, but damage plus 4 and adds a 4% chance to do a critical hit. Already we got a uh, nice dagger, secret dagger. And uh, you really won't find that weapon, I don't think, until about level 4, I think. But we got it early in level 2. How cool is that? I think it's awesome! Or as the secret would say, I think it's awesome! So I think that's all the secrets I want to look for. And let's, uh, <laughs> actually, let's finish level 2. Excuse me. You must be the envoy. Here's our guest. Bye, guys. Uh, uh, okay. I'm here to see the wizard Lord Menelag on behalf of Master Fenric. You must be Sarath. I was getting worried about you, though maybe for no reason. Uncle said you helped kill a Cyclops. No, oh, sorry. I'm Lyanna, Menelag's niece and pupil. Niece? Pupil? Hmm. Uncle will be so pleased to see you. But you'll want to wash up before dinner. Please, follow me. With pleasure. I mean, yes. Excellent. And, uh, Xana is a pervert. You couldn't tell. Yes. We've had a feast prepared in your honor. Actually, uh, Liana, before I follow you, I actually want to check up this ladder. Because it's, uh, is begging to be searched. Am I right? Aho! Jeez, I totally forgot about this place. Oh man, cool. Three secrets in the like, like little civilian intro level, basically. Full. Uh, all right, hold on. A full, a full health potion. How awesome is that? Uh, gonna be very important later in the game because this game gets kind of hard. I'm going. Welcome to the house of Menelaus. And I have four skill points, so I can use stealth level two. But that's next level. So you're Sabbath. Good to see you, lad. With those necromancers at the walls, watch it. With that, I was getting worried. I trust you brought the Shantiri crystal. Of course you have. Good. I'll take that, my lad, for safekeeping. Tomorrow we see you with it. Careful with that soup there to the Temple Isle, resting place of the Skull of Shadows. Let Arantir throw his army against the walls. We'll be off sealing his doom. Don't dismiss Arantir too lightly. There are rumors that he might be the Dark Messiah. No oh, stuff and nonsense, girl. All three of us know better than that. But the time is right for the prophecy. I'll worry about dusty old prophecies. You worry about the expedition. You're in charge of it, after all. <laughs> Of course, Uncle. Good night. And to you too, Sarah. Please don't tell me you find that sort of thing cute. Listen well, boy. I know why you're really here, but Liana doesn't, and we'll keep it that way. Fenric's business doesn't touch her. Understood? What are you talking about? Hmm. Perhaps you don't know. And that's probably for the best. The servants will show you to the guest house. Get some sleep, hero. We sail with the morning tide. 